use them? Okay, well that's good. Alright, so now, holy shit, yeah, they're gonna flatten our them. You see all these shells coming in? Oh my. Hello everybody, welcome back to another Easy Company event. We got a real special one for you guys today. I am your host, Dureg, and along with me I've got Mr. Pro. So, Mr. Pro, why don't you tell me what's going on today? So, from a look, explain to me what's happening right now. It's the British are gonna spawn at the first Airborne HQ. You can see that spawn point in the They are gonna have a couple of troops sneak all the way into town where they have their FOB set up. Once they have that built up, I believe all the British are going to spawn in, in the, this FOB that's in the urban center. And once the British are spawned in, the Germans are going to spawn in, and they're going to start getting in the vehicles and driving the convoy across. Oh, so this is essentially a bridge too far is what you're trying to say. Yeah, 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 it's a bridge too far, yeah. How interesting. Once the convoy gets up here, uh, I don't know if you've noticed, but here in the bridge, there's a lot of mines right now. Oh, I see them. It, it's unavoidable. They're going to hit them, and they're going to block the road. But yeah, they're going to block the bridge, so it's going to be a hectic fight. At some point, uh, then the Germans are going to spawn on the north side, because they were actually, um, in real life, there were reinforcements that came from the north side, from Bochol. So they're going to have a couple of Panzer IVs and uh, most of the infantry is going to spawn up north after uh, a little bit of fighting in the bridge. And except for one infantry squad that's going to stay on the south side, uh, putting pressure on. But uh, and then they're just going to have to, they're going to try to choke the British troops at the center uh, from the south and the north. So my history is a little bit off, but if I remember correctly, the Germans basically got massacred on the bridge, if I remember correctly, right? Well, the thing is, like, they, yeah, they had Piats, and uh, they did destroy the vehicles, creating a blockade in the in the bridge, so they, they couldn't move their vehicles across. So is the battle going to stop at some point, and the commander's going to meet on the bridge, or what? Yeah, all right, so the blockade is going to walk up to the, to the bridge, and he's going to ask for the British surrender, and um, the British are going to... In the, in the movie, they said um, that they didn't have enough room to take all the German prisoners. It's just a little, uh, a little cheeky from them, you know? Uh -huh. So uh, they're going to have a similar dialogue here, and after the British said no, uh, the German commander said flatten Arnhem, which basically meant start bombarding it with uh, tanks and mortars and artillery, and that's what's going to happen. Uh, we're going to bring, there's uh, there's about like six mortars placed uh, strategically, and they're going to start shelling, they're going to bring artillery, and uh, yeah, it's going to, all hell is going to break loose at that point. Sounds very exciting. So there's going to be a, co a couple really scenic moments in this uh, in this stream. Uh, I I'm looking forward to when the convoy walks up to the mines, looking forward when uh, the commanders interact, uh, trying to negotiate the surrender. And uh, at the very end, um, depending on who wins, uh, we will have uh, an actual surrender and we will march the defeated troops uh, down the bridge, whoever that is. Fob is down. Everybody's spawning in. There we go. Oh, look at them all rush out. It's almost like there's a war going on or something. <laughs> look at all of them. Yeah. Six guards, six guards, six guards. 68. Most of the ways out are in the south side of the fob, guys. So if you want to find an easy way out, the south side of the fob or north side of the fob. Let's go. East side of the fob and west side of the fob are not good. Not easy to get out. Looks like we got a roadblock underneath the bridge. A makeshift roadblock? Yeah, just some defenses, I guess. Whoa, hearing shots fire already. They aren't even ready yet. Why are they firing? Man, do we have uh, gunfire going off already? Yeah, it's interesting. Uh, 
Yeah, got them on the other side of the bridge. We're engaging. Just stay on this side of the bridge. Uh, Buffins, uh, secure. Get ready. Your squad ready to cross that bridge as soon as possible. Everyone else. Roger, roger. Hold fire if you can. Get familiar with your defenses on this side of the river. But, uh, so the Germans here, they, fi they have uh, finally spotted the British because uh, historically they did not know that they were here. So uh, yep, it seems like they've spotted them and started taking some shots. Now, now historically, they, it took them a little longer to see them. You know, they didn't see them across the bridge like that. But, but in this case... Hold fire for now. You know, I'd like to see what the hell they're shooting at. Let's see. I think they just see them around the buildings, kind of, you know. I see a few British people attempting to cross south now. Oh yeah, he sees a couple of them in the buildings. Yeah, he sees a couple of them in the buildings. I'm gonna give this perspective too. Ooh. Yeah, he's gonna bog down the big forces. Got a good shot from here. Why can't I just replace the barrel? You said I could go already. Yep, no, He's go, in, but whenever uh, you need support fire from the rest of our guys, uh, I want the AT guns to remain silent. Take the, shot. the guy in the half track hasn't spotted anybody yeah, yet, though. Okay, just aim for him so yeah. long as want AT guns to lean up. Uh, when the armored convoy uh, hits the machine, okay? So, the weapon's yellow. Weapons yellow until armored convoy hits the bridge and the mines on the bridge start going off. Oh, so you just AT guns can fire when everyone else can then? Yes. Well, not until that recon squad, like the enemy recon squad. Ambush, gentlemen. Ambush. Think yeah, ambush. ambush. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's when we're not supposed to fire to begin with, right? Yeah, so I guess that's the name of the game. It's supposed to be history written, right? Yeah, that basically that. Uh, we do the events after, you know, as, as historically accurate as we can. Just yeah, in real life, they didn't actually the know. Find all the machine guns, uh, but so here, the they map. obviously see him from across a bridge. So they're taking pod shots at our guys. We're taking fire already. Copy that. How, do you think you can push across that bridge or not? I have a feeling it's just Okay, we got some Brits on the right side and the left side of the bridge, but only the ones on the right side seem to be taking fire. The ones on the left seem pretty, uh... They've been ignored by the Germans for now. Keep trying to push for the most part. If you can, but if you feel like it's lost cause, then pull back to your secondary defense position. Yeah, the commanders at the top are basically right saying that they should probably pull back if it's, uh, too hot. And it was too hot <laughs> back then. Oh, the British can't even hop on the machine gun to fire back. Well, this guy's gonna try to do it. Is he gonna do it? Oh, he's hopping on the machine gun. Let's see how it goes. Some ID is in position. Oh, there. Okay. All right. All right, guys. Oh, I got it. I think this guy in the machine is not gonna last too long, man. This machine gun. Fire, fire, dude! What the hell are you doing? Oh, I got off. Why? I have no idea. Bro. Oh, well, I, I don't think it would have lasted too long, though. He doesn't have a lot of cover. Dude, he didn't even fire, did, man. Yeah. He could have at least suppressed least shot back at him. Hey, Lockie, looks like I um, need those two uh, replacements. What was that? Sorry? I might need the uh, two replacements. Uh, yep, you, what you need to go up into the replacement comms up up top. Are they still there? Damn, those two machine guns are really giving the British a bad time. It's like really bogging them down. Yep, yeah, they are. Um, originally, uh, I think I told you before, they had an armor yeah, car and a machine gun, but we there. just did a half truck and a machine gun. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Oh, no, oh, I think I see the Germans joining in now. Let's get in and hold. Good don't, move, don't move until we're all ready to go. Got it. Yeah, this machine gun is basically preventing the British from getting up on that other machine gun that's across the river. The one that's on the roof? Yep. Two of them over there. Just really, uh. Kind of a clusterfuck there. I'm hearing from the German command that uh, German reinforcements from the south are gonna arrive soon. The convoy should be on the way um, in a couple minutes. Well, that's gonna be fun. Let's see how that goes. Possible. I'm gonna put a point of interest down where you guys should be defending, roughly. All right, here's a sit rip, uh, sit Sir, rip, guys. For duty. No, original plan was uh, to rally and counterattack yeah, well, towards Ustbek with uh, no intelligence alone. informing of British presence in Arnhem. Plans have changed. Uh, the convoy is no longer heading through the city to the Ooh, northwest of Oosterbeek. The convoy's lines. objective now is to move oh, Blitzkrieg tactics well, to the northern the side of the bridge and. Yeah, so it looks like the British are retreating, on, at least from the bridge. Yes, uh, sorry, the German know. command is giving commands that they are going to uh, attempt a blitzkrieg on the north side of the so bridge. So they, once they're all up, they're going to just uh, go as fast as they can, try to make it north of the bridge. Alright, when you're when you're all squads are uh, ready, yep. are we to move to the other side of the bridge, or are we staying on the bridge and engaging the from there? Uh, we, we need to move on to the other side of the northern bridge as, as fast as we can and secure it. Right, right. So it seems like all the British have actually pulled back towards the bunker that's on the right hand side. We also got some British troops that are on the left. Uh, they're just taking... They're just trying to be low profile at this point. Roger that, yeah, they probably got the orders to pull back and uh, hold for now. 508, how's it going up there on that bridge? Um, as far as the Germans, they're all coming out uh, yeah, and getting their vehicles, get, uh, uh, the combo should be ready to go the, soon. Uh, enemy strength. Yeah, the British here just seem like they're really chilling out right now, just waiting for the enemy to come across that bridge. Um, they've really hidden themselves so that you can't actually see them from the other side. But I'm sure the moment that they get across that bridge, they're probably gonna pop up and be like, Hey, whack-a-mole. Hey! I'm sorry. <laughs> Someone join me. Easy company's ready. Yep. And WF is getting ready now, waiting for the last of the red eyes, and then we're good to go. Okay, WF is ready. Roger that. Alright, guys. Good luck. Today almost seems like a peaceful day, as if nothing is really going to happen. Ready? Here Roger we go. You, you have the green light to move, everybody. Green light to move, green light to move. Green light, there we go. North side of the bridge, must secure north side of the bridge. 508, once the whole convoy is past you, then you may come up our rear with your yeah, So the British are basically huddled us. The convoy started. Still can't find us. Get ready to rank. Yep, they're See moving out. Goes. Here comes the convoy, Durag! And here comes the Germans! FPS are tanking! <laughs> oh man, I can hear those engines purr from a mile away! Look at that convoy! I can already see it! Convoy might be coming at any point! Convoy coming! Convoy coming! Hold fire! Hold fire, guys! Hold fire! Let, con let the mines open up on them! Put the Good luck! Keep going! Keep going! They're gonna see the mines and be like, "What the hell?" That's the convoy, guys. Are 
a fucking massacre, holy hell! It's a fucking massacre, holy hell! Jesus Christ! God damn, they're even nailing the houses across the way. God damn, it's brutal. God damn, that FPS drop bro. They're all fucking dead. Yeah, oh. there's some like behind the vehicle, some Germans behind the vehicle trying to take off. Oh man, they're so doomed. Time to see so many explosions. This would be it. I've never seen so many vehicles blown up like that, dude. That was actually really epic. Super epic shot. Still got a couple of Germans that are on the bridge. I know, I don't know how they held up, man. They held up behind the vehicles somehow, but... Yeah. So, now that the explosions calmed down a bit, Durek, uh, this reminder, this is what happened. Um, the Germans' vehicles did run into mines. They ended up creating a blockade of the bridge, accidentally on their own. Oh! There's only one left. In my comms, I'm hearing that people are coming in from the south side. Which way south side? That is the south side. We have artillery has limited smoke rounds incoming. Germans are bringing in some smokes. Yeah, we got a couple of Germans that are underneath the bridge on the other side. I'm not sure what they're gonna do underneath that. Can they actually go underneath uh, the bridge on the other side? I don't know what they expect to do here. Can they go underneath? No, not in this map. Not on this not map? Not this map. Okay. Grave, you're able to. It's got like three levels, that bridge, but this one's only got one level. There's only one god. His name's Death. <laughs> Yeah, there's no way the Germans are getting past this unless they got a boat or something. You know, they actually used boats in uh, Nijmegen, in that bridge. It was, it was bloody. The 82nd Airborne had to cross a bridge just like this and uh, rafts, basically. They weren't even boats. Under German fire. Too bad the devs are not going to make Nijmegen, so we won't be able to do an event. Sounds like the Americans were sitting ducks in the dinghies when they tried to cross that river we were talking about.
What an amazing display by the British. I mean, they really held on tight here. They really are holding out, aren't they? You know, initially I thought that the Germans were going to do a lot better than this because they did see them across the river, but obviously that didn't happen. Oh, wow. Oh, snap. That just killed the whole squad. What a shot. That was a damn fine shot, I gotta say. We got nothing but elite troopers here. Yeah, those AT guns are just failing on these troops. Oh, damn! The rag. It's not gonna be in favor of the British the whole time, but it's gonna be a point where they're gonna get beat and get it shelled. Big time. I know, I know. Yeah, so, I know, I'm yeah, no, right now, yeah, right now it's like the Germans, don't, they can't get anything going on right now, but. I, mean, I wasn't expecting that AT gun to actually hit that spot. Oh my god, yeah, that AT gun's right on point. I thought they had some sort of cover, but they're all dead. Um, they did increase the HE damage with the last big patch, so uh, any HE round ago, this, this should be pretty lethal. Now we're starting to see more British people coming up on the left side of the bridge. Uh, I don't know if they're going to have any, you know, trouble or anything like that. that there's only going to be one squad pushing the south side of the bridge and we're going to get uh, more troops coming from the north side to try to chop down the British people. You have gone down, you, uh, so the British people are going to be, or the German people are going to be coming in from the north, is what you're saying? Yes, they're going to be coming from the north as well. Copy. You have uh, Luftwaffe and artillery. I think you can actually see them. I think, I don't know. Scroll up to the top here. Yeah, I see a couple of German guys spawning up at the very north. Man, Red Eye is actually getting uh, pretty close to the north side of the bridge. They really, really want it, they're already halfway. Close to halfway. But then we also have Easy Company coming up. They're about to do a little tiny clash right here. Oh, there's, there's already one, like, right next to him. He doesn't even know that they're there. Oh! I think all of Reddy just died right there. Yeah, all of Reddy just got killed. Damn. Yeah, there's a couple of easy guys on the south side of the bridge trying to salvage what they have right there. Yeah, the troops in the north are still getting organized. We'll come back to them. Uh, is this face that we're Yep, yep. 
Yeah, easy company just pushed out of. Oh shit! God damn! strike or do we have more so do I waste this one now or can, can we repeat the use uh, we have uh, artillery available now in this limited window we do not know if we will have it later for because the uh, troops and the, rest of the, uh, are getting uh, the commander is telling the rest of the troops uh, that they want them to push north 10 rounds on infantry marker next to a uh, bridge to the west Roger that. Uh, infantry yeah. marker to the west Like, I don't see that many people falling back. There's just a bunch of people still at the bridge. So we're on phase 2 now, Durek. Um, there's gonna be one squad full of snipers, you know? <laughs> that should be fun. We shall see. I guess historically they said that um, every time they would come out of Arnhem, I mean, every time they would come out of building on Arnhem, the British would either get killed by a mortar or a sniper. So we're gonna try to reproduce that as well by having one squad that's full of snipers. We'll see how that goes. Alright, well, we got a bunch of Germans coming in from the north side, I believe. Yeah, north side. Yep, I'm gonna come to see that push. We want to maintain a perimeter around the FOB. We don't want to get too far away from the FOB. Roger, I'm just gonna have people stationed. Oh, I hear their artillery shooting from afar. Oh, what's that inbound. I think I hear a tank? Yeah, there should be a couple of Panzer IVs on the north side. The Germans are not allowed to cross the platoon bridge, uh, but shoot them either way. They're not allowed to cross anymore, though. So, hey, we got a Panzer IV with a couple of troops following it. Uh, looks like they're moving in from the, uh... This is that they're going southeast. Probably gonna circle around, come in from the east side. What that hit? Is that a dot? I, I don't know. They, I didn't see the bomb actually go off. I think that was a dud. <laughs> I think. Somebody's not going to be happy that their payload didn't go off. Alright, let's get a sit rep. Uh, 103rd, both flanks. How's that? How's that progressing? Uh, right flank is moving, left flank is currently holding, waiting for their supporting uh, infantry. I believe it's the 508, correct? Yep, 508. They're spawning in there. Yep. You. How's the cathedral we going? should uh, sink our attacks at coming. the same time, so east and west yeah, hits the over. city at the same time. Redeploy at this point at the HQ and move to secure the cathedral from the north. Copy that. Moving there now. Oh, it looks like there's a bunch of fighting going on over at the church. Might be uh, shooting at uh, the Germans on the other side. Don't expect the defense is too far to the north, guys. We do not want to spread out too much. We want to keep this pretty concentrated. Oh shit, the there's already Germans area. in the church. Yeah, they're going to take over this cathedral and it's through. going to be where the snipers are going to be set up and they're going to be able to look over all of Arnhem. I did not realize that. Copy that. It's starting to go a bit silent, so the enemies are probably reorganizing right now for a push. Uh, so keep hey, your eyes open in all directions. Yep, we got a bunch of Germans that are going all the way to the top, I guess. Look at him climb! Command Red Eye has to go to the cathedral. Roger that, Red Eye, dig in, get a perimeter around, and call out enemy movements to the flank attacks. Copy that. Squad 3, watch out, make sure you keep away from train station, do not cap it. Uh, squad leaders, yep. be advised, I have eyes on enemy entrenchment. Infantry times one AT gun. So we got a German squad that's coming up to the bell tower. We got another German squad that's literally so, on the so other side. On the other side of where Perfect. the freaking uh, point is. We 
need that secured, and we need to... Yeah, I was following the Recon squad, that's, um, I believe they're gonna try to post their set themselves in the cathedral as well. So it's such a good spot to see the whole city. Konstantes Rauchsperrfeuer, ein Mörser links von der Brücke, der zweite rechts. Tank coming from armor, the south, south of the river. Copy that, copy that. Watch out, AT markers. Everybody's Where's screaming armor, armor. everybody's screaming yeah. armor. Let's get those AT guns in motion. Where's the armor? AT gun is down. Ooh, that armor took a big shot out of one of the squads down to the, uh... I'm seeing it, yeah, they, they took the AT gun out and then they're still, they're firing. There goes one AT. They still got one. Ugh. Oh, he missed. Wait, wait, did he miss? That yeah, one hit. That one hit it. Yep. Good hit. Panzer is backing off. Panther is backing off. Oh, the Panzer, my bad. Oh, is there still a super shake available? Luftwaffe. Uh, uh, Stukas are not available, but the uh, Luftwaffe 109 the strafers are uh, still around. Alright, Strafe uh, 109 is following them. We got a fight going on on the other side of the cathedral. Uh, I'm gonna check to see what's going on over there. Oh, I see that. Where are you? I'm gonna go check first. that out too. Look, yes, Looks like the British know that they're in the church. Yeah, the British look like they've been caught off guard because it looks like they actually lost a lot of guys out there. Right next to the cathedral. Santi have eyes on enemy in the church tower. In the church tower, the big one. Yup. Striping Roger Russian that. Got a bunch of Germans that are pushing in on this tiny squad next to the cathedral. Well, that's basically all the British, they were all wiped out Pretty in this general area. Yeah, there might be like one guy there. So it seems like they're sending out an AT squad to go look for the tanks. They're gonna try and hunt it down. Seems like, uh, well, one of the tanks on the east side, one of the tanks on the west side. It's actually pretty smart. Alright, let's get situation reports, please. Let's go uh, west flank. How's that going? Command, again, are we free to fire on these uh, Germans down here? This is south flank, a pint on the bridge, in the middle of the bridge. Up on the north side. Yeah. What? You, yeah, do you have contacts over there? Roger, roger that, roger that. If you keep uh, keep the pressure up on the south, oh, that, that means that they've, they're using assets to keep you pinned their host stuffing, which weakens their north. Yeah, there's a tank and a full squad of infantry here. Yes, yes, if you got contacts over there, engage those contacts now. Seems like the British just figured out where the tanks are up in the north. They're going to be flanking it from... Uh, the north of the Germans' position that's up there. What about two sides of the building? Oh, yeah, they're gonna come up behind it and shoot it. Affirmative, it's 10 meters. Oh, they don't even know the British are here. We have MG5 coming in from the other question mark here. 0.1 miles, so I don't think I just saw them. 
While the Panzer IV is taking off, it's too fast. There's no way they're going to be able to catch up to it in time. Still a pretty open space between where the British are and the Panzer are in now. It's a huge open field. These Germans don't even realize that there's British walking up right behind them. We'll be here for a rude awakening. Opening up on him. I'm just worried because spaghetti, you were saying you were going to come back. Radar has the odds up here in the tank. Affirmative. Yep. Copy. Copy. Yeah, they're starting to shoot at this uh, Panzer IV on the east. Yeah, I'm looking at the one that's on the west, and this one is not in a good position. It could easily get surrounded. The one on the east is pulling back uh, since an ATK and she took a shot at it. The one that's on the west is inside the outskirts of the town, just by the river. Uh, there's a bunch of, there's a tiny British squad that's on the other side of them. They don't actually realize that they're there. I see them, yeah. That cathedral, you have my permission to move in there and take that cathedral. Only if you think you can take it though. We cannot take it, we're getting sniper fire. We can't get across that road. Copy that, then set up a defensive perimeter uh, looking in that direction. Yeah, I don't think these guys have anything to actually take out the tank. Yeah, it looks like the Germans actually have the cathedral all locked down. Yeah, th that west side's definitely looking uh, quite German crowded. Yeah, that west side might be the crux there. Seems like it, yeah. There is more cover on the west side to advance because the east side seems like an open field. If I was the driver of this Panzer IV, I'd be panicking a little bit. I don't like driving in this uh, small quarters, you know? Yeah, 77. Says uh, the Panzer IV gives you. Yeah, Panzer III or Panzer IV don't give you uh, the best visibility out of all tanks. So you give you. No, but at least you can stick your head out. <laughs> Sorry, what was that, Buffins? Actually, 501st. We've been here for like an hour, dude, right? Time's flying by. Oh! Dude, the tank on the west side is taking hits. From what? Not good. I don't know. I think it was a PAD or... I don't know, but it definitely... The engine's out. Engine's out. Oh, it's a PAD. Oh, saw that. There she goes. Rip. Nice work, nice work. So it looks like the tank might have been dealt So they took care of the armor that was on the west side. They did. You know who was driving that tank? Erwin Rommel. <laughs> That's his actual name. No. <laughs> Such a shameful display. Alright, so it seems like the British have lost both of their ATs. Um, they say that they have one in reserve, but I don't see it anywhere. Uh, they're, gonna, they're probably gonna have to rely uh, on I think it's over here by squad 4, isn't the sign? I, I see the symbol. Yep, I see one. They got it, uh, if you see me on the minimap, I'm sitting on it. <laughs> it's a very hidden AT canyon, that's funny. They still have at least two anti-tank guns, so... Wait, they have three anti-tank guns, dude. So yeah, yeah, they lost two, but I think they have one left as far as I know. No, no, they got three. I see two that are being manned right now. Wait, no. They have four? What the hell? They have two to the east, on the east side of the road, one by squad three, almost by the main road, and another one being manned on the west side, southwest side. Uh, by squad well, from six. what I'm hearing, it sounds like they want to divert them to a different location. Uh, Roger that. We have uh, I think they said to the west? Yep. Or east? Yeah. I don't know. I can hear. Uh, Commander, uh, we have one team member uh, who got dropped out of the server. I heard a vehicle start up in this direction. Five of first, you want to try and help uh, Buffin squad take the cathedral? You want to try and move over to... I'm going to put a point of interest down for you. Point of interest 30. 
Do you want to move your guys up there and get ready to make a push on the cathedral? Okay, I'm seeing another German squad move up on the west side again, towards where the tank got destroyed. Looks like they're at half health, so maybe they were healing each other. the pans already so the germans aren't as strong as they were on the west side um it seems like the only thing that they have locked down a little bit is the church but i only see like a grand total of three germans there or four germans there with british guys pushing in from behind i see the one single british guy no there's two there's another one on the side Any skirmishes going on? On uh... Oh, it looks like they're trying to cross the bridge a little bit. Six guards are securing zero one. Copy, nice work. Not a whole lot of Germans on the other side of the bridge. I'm pretty sure they're all in the north. Not a lot of action right now. I feel like there's uh, little groups all over the place, but they're not actively engaging um, too much right now. Yeah, I just see like a bunch of, uh, or not a bunch, like As a, a tiny squad FGJ. shooting across the bridge. 103. Oh yeah. Uh, getting me on top support. There's still squad 6 to uh, pose them. Let's see that fight. We are too far behind enemy lines to uh, I'm not asking for anything to, to die, I'm just saying I'm bugged out, I cannot even type respawn. Oh, okay. You can't even type respawn? Where are you? That's 7 PE. That's all your guys are in the north. Alright, so we got a couple of British forces coming in to push I'm out that uh, German six, forces six, right here. Okay, I'll come and uh, kill you then. Alright. Uh, contact the guys who are in there, they're engaged. Uh, they're they uh, engaged. Got me, got me. Point of interest. We got another little British squad that's pushing into the cathedral. Yeah, this other British squad just basically wiped out all these Germans to the southwest. I don't see any more alive here. Oh. What about that point of, that point of interest? Yeah, 49. Definitely seems some good action there. I have a bit of a... It's kind of a stalemate in this general area. Sounds like we're taking mortar fire. Ooh, what a massacre on both sides over here. We got Germans and British both down, but it seems like the Germans came out on top. The Germans were basically holed up in the cathedral, and they had the upper hand. Marcus said, big area please, big a huge area. Big so overall, it looks like the Germans haven't really Spacing is progressed. Oh, like you said, it's a stalemate, it's a... Uh... Both forces are fighting. Smoke incoming, house up. Hey, I see the Germans pulling out of the cathedral, though. All of them. Yeah, they're probably pulling out. Um, we got a couple more British guys coming up from the other side of the cathedral. We also got uh, some smoke on the north side of the bridge for uh, for an attempt to push. Yeah, but so far it seems like the British are really holding off here. They're holding off, but I also feel like the Germans are getting a little bit of a foothold and making the British perimeter a little tighter, you know? Not much, but I feel like it's a little tighter. I think the Germans on the west side were actually doing a really good job, but they really didn't commit there. Like, it just kind of fizzled out there. At least I don't see that many... Oh, wait, I see a squad of Germans actually pushing in towards the uh, fob there on the west side. They're like one block over. Yeah, this is a squad that came out of the cathedral, I believe. Oh, oh! That one British guy might knock them all out. Let's see how it goes. Oh snap, he basically took out almost all of them. He took out almost all the squad. I don't like the fact that I'm that direction. Oh, this guy's a trooper. He's coming after him. He's coming up right behind you. Oh snap, Let's see what he does. Man, I have such a hard time following people sometimes in this building. Oh, 
Oh, everybody? No way! Oh, he doesn't see him. One he doesn't see him. Oh! 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 Dude, that yeah, if that have been there. Wait, who was that? Thank you, thank you, thank you. That was, uh... Thank you. Yeah, we've got a 34 pretty close to the FOB, just north of you 780. Corporal Smithy from the 501st. Damn, you could've freaking took out an entire squad right there. Hey, man, what is red yeah, he did here? good. He held him up. He almost had him. They're right on top of the point, uh, S2. The least you could say about him is that he stuffed that tiny squad. He did. He took out everybody but what, like two people? Yeah. Okay, uh, yeah clear. Oh, that was great. What's that? What a defense by Corporal Smith. Um, I see a British troop coming uh, from the south side of where the engagement was. We just saw do rag. Oh, damn. There's like the whole British army moving in on this tiny little German fraction that's right here. Oh, they're throwing grenades. Oh! I don't want to move. That grenade got both of them. Yeah, it did. Oh, you got Germans coming up right behind you! Germans coming up right behind you! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Did the Germans not see them? I don't think the Germans see them. Yeah, I don't think the Germans actually saw those guys walking by. No, they're literally just one block away and they don't see each other. You guys are gay. Oh my god, these guys have got to be the most sneakiest Germans I have ever seen. This is the 508 coming in right behind the British! Ooh. My, my, they are on the other side of the building and they don't see each other. It's two full squads. Fucking amazing. Alright, so let's see, we got British coming around the corner. My god, talk about urban fighting going from building to building. Ooh, what a shot! Oh, grenades! I don't think that got anybody though. Hey, tanks pushing up, my position's getting threatened. Are you tank, are you guys going to deal with I'm it? I'm hearing reports of a tank. We got a tank guard, yeah. coming in from the yeah. east side. Seems like the Germans got the upper hand of this engagement on this side. The rig. Looks like we got the Panzer IV coming in from the east side. Uh, it looks like he's trying to get through that mini roadblock that's right there. Let's see what he does. Are they trying to uh, dig it out? Or maybe put a charge on it? Uh, I'm not sure. And then we also got yeah. Germans coming in from the bridge. They're actually basically almost on the other side. This Panther Lee has done very well to stay alive this whole time, and he's uh, successfully gotten closer and closer. Every time he's gotten spotted by an AT gun, right. he just uh, relocated. How's it going on that top? Very good work. Well, you, should you should bring it up to Kenny. The bridge might very well be in trouble because there's only like two British guys that are actually holding off this German squad. They might need some help. I'm not sure that the British actually have the manpower to actually send any more troops over here though. We got a big airplane, where's it going? Those British that were holding the bridge, I don't think they're holding anymore, direct. They were. <laughs> <laughs> oh, one survived. One survived this Tuka. What does he have, an MG? Yep. Oh, wait, there is one here, right? Oh my god, there's like... There's a British to the... There's a British and a German, and the only thing that's separating them is a box. I'm seeing more fire oh. on the bridge. Wait. That was the last German. Alright, going over towards the cathedral. Oh, I think I heard a tank blow up. Oh no. Yep, the Panzer IV on the east side is down, Durek. Yeah, I see it. Nice work, nice work. Ah.
Had a good run. No, nah, not really. I mean, the Panzers really haven't done much this game. Like, they've just gotten to the outskirts of the town and just basically exploded. <laughs> At least it's out late the other end. <laughs> I guess. Yeah. I don't know how much pressure to actually put onto them. I mean, it's really hard for it's, a tank to actually do urban fighting. That, that's what I was saying. Yeah, it's like, I mean, it's you're getting blocked. Your vision's getting blocked. They can sneak from everywhere. Yeah, I would not want to be a tank crew in this map. So it looks like the Germans are pushing back into the cathedral. Uh, there's a lot more Germans than there are British. Oh, hey, Durek, uh, get ready. Find Kenny, and I'm going to find Lucky. They're going to have that talk on the on the bridge. They're going to uh, do the surrender. All squad ceasefire. Last life in the town. Everyone else in the north hold at the fob. Occupy all mortars on northern fob, please. Well, host often hold attack on the south. Occupy all mortars on the south. Get your zeros in on point of interest that I will place now. Copy. We are asking for the Allied surrender. Uh, Commander, where do you want us to go? Well, hold on, guys. I'm getting word that enemy command wants to negotiate. They're gonna send a man across this bridge. I want to ceasefire, everyone. Ceasefire. A for Chairman approaching on west side of bridge. We'll be escorting him in. Copy that. I'll talk to him on the bridge. That's far enough. We can hear you from there. My general says there's no point in continuing this fighting. He is willing to discuss your terms of surrender. We haven't the proper facilities to take you all prisoner. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> what? We would like to, but we can't accept your surrender. Is there anything else? to accept his surrender. <laughs> so, they have not accepted our surrender. Flatten Adam! All mortars, open fire! Did you get to hear the local voice though? Okay, well that's good. Alright, so now, holy shit, yeah, they're gonna flatten Adam. You see all the oh, shells yeah. coming in? Oh my. We got a bunch of Germans that are shooting from across the bridge. Oh, we just got a bunch of British that just went down on their side of the bridge. <laughs> Looks like a majority of the British forces are falling back to the cathedral. Maybe they're trying to take shelter? This shot is actually amazing, dude, right? Okay. 
back. Looks like we got a gigantic German force coming in from the north side. Yeah, the commander has ordered everybody to uh, spawn on the north side, and that's where we're gonna try to their attempt to push from. We got a bunch of British that are sitting inside the cathedral, but it looks like a bunch of them are getting wiped out in the tower. Man, what a display that was. The amount of firepower that was used by the Germans right there, crazy. Wasn't that amazing, that shelling? Holy that crap. Was, that was so perfectly was spread out. If only the buildings could, if only the buildings could actually crumble, that'd be amazing. Could yeah. collapse, yeah. Dude, that would have been amazing, yeah, if they could be destroyed. Yeah. Wow, that's amazing. I, I'm really, I'll stay for now with the convoy blowing up and that shelling. Amazing, those two points. Alright, I'm gonna move to the north side direct because all the Germans are gonna do a push from there. Uh, there's a Tiger tank there as well, so um, should be a big push from the Germans now. Stick with the British and the, uh, the Roger that. So let's get ready to take those things out. Let's lure them from the city, and they can't do very well in CQB. Wow, I see them. Huge force coming in. Northeast, Point of interest, not anymore. West front is putting uh, uh, the 77. Continue to watch the bridge, but if things get real bad, we'll have to get you to move further north. All right. Keep those tigers alive, boys. Ten times infantry north. Those tigers as well. Maintain a perimeter, guys. But it looks like they're coming in directly. The Germans right are marching down they south with music and everything, man. They're ready for battle. 77th, you might be having contacts mostly coming from here north, south, and south. So be aware of that. Hey, Six guards in north of you, but I don't know if they're going to hold out. If we get too much heavy contacts on the east, we'll have most of our guys less pulled to the east, alright? Tiger, Tiger, you move up. Need smoke? Bravo, move up. So it looks like the Germans have actually spotted the uh, cathedral, which I mean, it's the most obvious target, so... It also seems like the British have spotted the Germans and they're starting to take down a few. Uh, Germans are smoking out the whole place. Wow, a lot of, a dirt, lot of uh, smoke grenades. There's a couple of British guys on the AT right here. They don't realize that the convoy is actually on the next street over. So they have it flipped around looking the wrong direction. There's a German that's coming around the corner and it's just going to kill these guys on the AT. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. They're about to lose the AT that they have on this side. Oh, it looks like the German forces are getting bogged down there. A lot of radio chatter coming from point of interest 14. Well, they were, uh, they were a blob, you know? Looks like we got two British guys flanking around the Tiger. I'm guessing they have Piats. I'm curious to see how that goes. What's the situation up on the north side? Okay. Uh, we got multiple coming in, Tiger coming in. We're gonna Copy go that, Looks like the tiger's swinging out far to the east. Yeah, I see that it's turning like a long flank. Hopefully we'll be able to actually be effective and shoot something from there. I don't know how much we'll be able to see, you know? Oh, 
So it looks like we got a bunch of tiny crumbs of British moving around the general area of where the Germans are. It's not an entire force, but I believe they're trying to flank the Germans. Right, but the Germans are coming in full force, man. Like, look at the minute map. It's insane. <laughs> Oh, no minimap, but the actual map. <laughs> There's no minimap here. Alright, feet. West front is both target team. So it looks like the main British force is actually trickling in, but uh, they're coming in from the spawn area, so they couldn't really make it any more obvious. Hopefully the Germans don't catch on, but uh, you never know. Looks like the Tiger tank that's just across the way is shooting the shit out of the British guy. Oh, they're now allowing Riley's in the city limit, so it'll be easier to push them back. At least for the Germans, anyways. Literally one street over, and there's like ten British and ten Germans about to fight. Most accurate one. Copy that. Nothing I can do. We have no that tiger's slinging his gun. What's he gonna look for? I think he's looking at the British. Uh, there's a lot of British on that side. Yeah, but he didn't shoot. That was frustrating. Damn it! What is it with people not shooting in this game? Yeah, so it looks like. The Germans are kind of getting stuck in that one area. Enemy Tiger is destroyed. I'm nice hearing on the British comms that the Tiger that's across the way on the other side of the river got destroyed. That one's down. Ooh! Ooh, that was nice, Tuka. It didn't get anybody though, it missed. I got yeah. two people, didn't I? I got a couple. Ah, uh, just a, a little more, he would have killed that entire if, house. If they, if they would have put yeah. him on that building, ooh, he would have taken that been most all of them. Right there. You know, it seemed like the Germans kind of stopped at this church and they're having a hard time pushing further south. That's what I've been saying, like the British have been pretty rock solid like, mm -hmm. all around yep, so yep. far. Uh, Yep. It's just that the British are like, I think their problem is that they're like clumping up in one area. They need to like take two squads to go around the other side because all the British are looking that way. Oh yeah. Like there's no British over to the north side. Like everybody's just focusing on the east. Mm, if if a British squad could go around the north side and catch them from the back, they would totally decimate that. Uh, so we got a German unit, unit uh, squad seven, that's coming in from the north north side there. But he's kind of far away. Like he needs to do it like right now. Well, the British are distracted. Hey, did they take one tiger? Yeah, right, yeah. Or yeah, they killed one on the other side of the river to the east, in between two boats. I think it was Erwin Rommel's, too. Erwin Rommel? He doesn't live up to the name, does he? I know, he really doesn't. <laughs> Like, I mean, there's not much that the tanks can really do because. Oh! Oh! Infantry behind the tiger. Engine out. The 
British think that the tiger is destroyed, but as you can see here, it's just out of action. Mm -hmm. Yep, they got it. They got the engine back up. They got the engine functioning. Yeah, they don't realize that the tiger's still alive. No, actually, I see a few Germans uh, heading south uh, by this lake, using the cover of the altitude of the ground. Looks like we got a couple of Germans that are coming here from the north side of the cathedral. There seems to be a full squad here. Oh, very nice. They're spreading out a bit. Uh, judging by the comms, it seems like they've been spotted by the British. Probably the ones that are sitting outside this cathedral. Y'all, yeah, the Germans that are at the tinier church are getting mollywhopped. The British are basically pushing into the church, you know, really squeezing on it. Uh, I mean, not the church. Actually, yeah, the church. That is a church, right? Yep. There's a church and a cathedral. So at this point, I'm sure that the British that are on the east side know that that tiger is alive and kicking right now. I see another German vehicle. What's that? Wait, it's a second tiger. Wow, that holy hell. Oh my goodness. That killed a lot of British guys. They killed a full squad right there. Okay, we got another tiger. I know, that's what I was saying. Man. Where did the second tiger come from? Uh, I think uh, Loki said that there were going to be additional uh, tanks, you know, if needed, so. One more Panzer IV and one more tiger. Oh, oh. Oh shit! We got a British guy that came up from the backside with the Willie Jeep. Oh my god! He blew the blew the shit out of the tiger. Hero he was. <laughs> he tried. What a hero! He tried. We got both tigers pulling out. They're both basically limping. I see that, dude. He did sneak by. He got two hits on it. Who was this hero? We need his name. T Bone. Let me see. Don't worry. It's Corporal Smitty again. Can you imagine? <laughs> Uh, we got reports of enemy infantry by the FOB. Uh, but I'm not seeing anybody. We have Germans that are really close to it, though. They're like just north of it. Remember, all squads rallies. Good. Rallies good. The north headed to the FOB. Copy that, B. Yeah, that German squad is inching closer and closer to that fob. Um, Lieutenant Spaghetti, can you set up a defensive area around 76? 76? Yeah. I think I just heard another tiger go down. Jesus, the British, man. Copy. Oh, yeah, I saw, I saw one just explode right now. I think it's a newer one, too. <laughs> no? We're taking it. We can't give Erwin Rommel a tank, man. <laughs> it's not a tank, man. It's, uh, there's not enough maneuverability. No, there's really not. Like if anything, you have to shoot, shoot him from a distance. Oh, this German's trying to be a hero. Is this German trying to be a hero? Oh no, he did. Oh no, it's alive. Yeah. Left, you're left, you're left. Oh my god, you're so dead. Man, this close quarter combat is insane. It's urban fighting. Yeah, 
Yeah, but it looks like this squad isn't going to be able to save the day. They were that close, though. They were extremely close. They were, like, other side of the building. Uh, sounds like we got one more. Looks like the last Tiger tank is getting destroyed. I don't know what I got hit by, though. Oh, and there it goes. The last Tiger tank. Ah, uh, sad. I don't know what I got hit by, though. I was uh, watching on the east side. There was a small engagement. The British clear out all the Germans here. Oh, it looks like we got a couple of Germans coming in from the bridge. Oh, I see that. Nice. Yeah, I just heard in comms they might be able to secure the uh, north part of the bridge. Ooh, they took over the pillbox on the north side of the bridge. This is big. Okay, that was a big concentration right there. Oh man, if it was... No. If it was just a little closer, they could have gotten an entire freaking squad right there. Yeah, look, at this, look at this German squad on the north though. They uh, they might be able to find the FOB soon. If they go a little further up north. Uh, I don't think this British actually see well, off for home now. We see him now. If there is anyone down there. Grenade! Yeah, that squad is going to be. Kenny, can you give me a marker? I've got him pinched down from both sides, from the bridge and from the north. Yeah, they're both getting stuffed. The bridge is just ironclad. They can't get past them. They are, they are. Anthony Hopkins is really directing these people, man. He's really leading them. <laughs> oh, damn. Grenades. Grenadiers. Take them out. Yeah, the Germans, they just... They just, uh, I don't know. You know, they, get, they don't have a... Use your kits, boys. Use your kits. We're gonna do that. Yeah. Right. We'll take those passes up. We got another tank coming in. Sounds like a tiger. No, that's not a tank. Panzer IV. Panzer IV coming in from the north side. He's taking the roads. Probably not the best idea, but what can you do? Well, like, you know, at least they gotta try it at least once, right? They kept staying outside the the town this whole time, so let's see how this goes. We got a Piat coming up. Oh my god, there's a lot of Germans and British in one freaking building at the same time. I see it, I see it. It's right next to the Panzer 4, right? Yeah. Holy crap. Look at this shit. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, 
Oh, oh no. Four second shots now. I heard a pee in. Oh, it's a gamble grenade. Uh oh, there it goes. Oh, blood for the Germans. Yeah, the Germans are just getting their asses handed to them. Dude, the British products. are holding the bridge. They got told to hold the bridge by General Urquhart. And they're holding it. Yeah, I don't know. I'm hearing two more Panzer IVs are coming from the north. There were a lot of times that the Germans could have had it, but... Oh, look no, at this. British we got, we got a German squad fight. coming in from the southwest. Ooh, I, I see that, I see that, yeah. Let's okay, check that out. There isn't a whole lot of British right Oh, we, oh, we got two British. Yeah, these British guys are on point, though, I gotta say. They really are. They're giving it a great fight. It's Corporal Smithy, he's going in for the kills. Actually, sorry, change uh, mortar rounds to artillery marker north Damn, he knew it. He knew they were there. He had to have known somehow. Yeah, it seems like that tiny attack force just got stuffed uh, from the south there. Yeah, I see a couple still alive, but uh, yeah, definitely. Good, targets for an artillery strike? good uh, ship, good uh, ship to fire by the British, though, you know. Oh, yeah. yeah, just uh. Okay, we're gonna. I only see Germans on the north side. I see more towards the south and east. I see a couple of Germans that are just to the north, but uh, it's a very, very tiny force. There's no way they're going to be able to take it on. Oh, the artillery might take out the bomb. Ooh. Maybe. We've got a few defenses. It's a big spread. Yeah, they still don't know where the fob is, that other just a really bad shot. Either way, they still missed it. They've just been on, they've just been really off with these bomb strikes if they were trying to hit the uh, fob there. Um, we got another squad by the river on the south side uh, getting supported by a uh, Panzer, so they might be able to get something going on. Maybe <laughs> some scrap metal, if nothing else. 
far as south, yeah, southwest. Uh, we'll either see a win or another light show. Either way. Let me know if you need backup. to hit a uh, Panzer IV. Oh, I see it from behind. Oh, he's gonna plant a charge on it. Wow. Gonna be a hero. Oh man, he's got two Panzers. Oh, what do you do? Oh, he's a sapper. He's a sapper. Oh, come on, let's go, let's go. Yeah! Oh wait, the satchel's right there. That was what nice! Oh, he didn't actually take the tank out, but it disabled it. What a hero, bro. What a fucking hero. That's one path is down. And there's two guys with a Piet in front of this other Panzer that's uh, got the engine disabled, so I don't think it'll last too long. I just don't think tanks are going to be very useful here, man. They just keep getting destroyed before, before they can do anything. They're starting to run out of tickets too, so... Yeah, it's not even... Uh, what do you call it? This isn't a map that tanks are going to be good on because there's not enough maneuverability to dodge all the, you know, the shots. Yeah, that's really not. Um, if you're going to send in a tank, you have to have infantry really help it out. Somebody in this room is like, no wonder the Germans had no tanks later in the war. They lost, it all. They lost them all in Arnhem. <laughs> looking at all this urban fighting, seeing a bunch of troops like looking into the windows. Yeah, just holding up roadblocks. Pretty crazy. They're gonna blow up that last tank that's to the south. We got contact south. Contact south of FOB in the square south of FOB. I will say the Germans are getting closer though. Way closer, like, yeah. They're on top of the FOB basically now. There goes yeah, another, uh. There's another Panzer, Panzer right? Yeah. yeah. Another one. Another one. Another one. Another one. You know, if I was the Germans, I would stop with the tanks and just go full infantry because the tanks take like 20 tickets, man. 20 or 25 tickets. Way too much. Let's go in. Go in as infantry now, Salty. Yep. Yeah, the British have really stopped like defending their main positions. They've all fallen back to the FOB 
and just basically done like a square position where they're just looking all around. Guys, oh my god, guys, I think that that was the closest minutes. German to actually No grenades, please, no grenades. Oh, we got another German coming in. He's underneath all these guys. I need a found a fire, found a fire. Oh, there, there's another my German. Position, my position. My position. Fob is my well, I gotta do it. We got multiple Germans coming in from the north side. They're pouring in from like a tiny building. Uh, I didn't even realize that they were there. For some reason, they're not, they're not lighting up on my screen all that they're even here. Cease fire. All Axis forces cease fire. All Axis forces cease fire. All the ground. All the ground. All yeah, I'm Axis hearing uh, Kenny fire. saying... Uh, I'm hearing Kenny say that, that they want to surrender. Fire. And I'm scared, I'm getting Hold fucked. fire. Hold fire, hold, hold fire. position. Medics. Medic. Medic. Medic can revive, Medics. it's not against the Geneva Convention. Although the British fought valiantly, the Germans would eventually take over Arnhem. With the British hardly getting any supplies, they were forced to surrender. Across the bridge. Somebody took a picture of me. Hurry up. Is this the pride mark? Oh, dude, right. that's a big accent. Right, mark. Oh hey, no smoke grenades, no smoke grenades. No more. Hugsley, hurry up. You're already guessing us. Hugsley, oh, hurry up. Are you already guessing us? Yo, fuck you, Harley. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Harley, I'm going to wait. Yo, Guther here, look it up, you're wrong. <laughs> Okay. I'm a bleeding man here. Who's up to uh, the police station to deal with W Canopy, rescue by East Company? Everyone's not gonna do it. Get the spoons, lads, get the spoons. Yo, send me a ticket for the water. Have permission to jump. No, fuck the safety. Hey, if I stab them, let me let me let me check a game involved with my feet. Trust me, it'll be fine. Try it. Please, let me fuck it. Thank you, medic. Yeah, I'm gonna make a break for it. <laughs> 53, understood? Yeah. <laughs> you see that guy with the car coming to the captain and the other For those wondering, this is the greatest thing to make a move of are you sure that isn't the decal on? How does this guy have to be a decal? Oh, fuck. I don't know. Dude, the German commander just gave an order to finish them all. <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs>